Adventure for all! Woo! <laughs> Say, I got this. I got this. Never give up, right? Never give up. Today's a big day. The goal is to get everybody riding around 20 yards on their own independently, because we kind of feel once they can do that, they have enough balance and skill to uh, keep progressing with their family. So, big day today. A lot of fears being faced. My name is Brad Huff. I'm here volunteering with Adventure for All in Bentonville, Arkansas at beautiful Kohler Preserve. And it has been truly inspirational every day. The community here is just absolutely unbelievable. I was a part of planning a lot of the tour and everybody I reached out to connected me with as many people as they could and it, it truly was awe-inspiring at how kind and generous everybody uh, is in the Bentonville community. Adventure for All reached out through some connections. They're looking for space to be in Bentonville, uh, and we thought Kohler would be a perfect spot for them where we can connect them to, to, to nature and to other people in the community, and, and Kohler hopefully is a great place for them to be to learn how to ride bikes. We can all line up on this line right here. The group setting, the activations we do in the morning, that sets the tone for everyone to realize we're there together. We're there to accomplish something, to test ourselves. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Look at those. <laughs> one more, one more. Or, or, or. These individuals don't have disabilities. They actually have exceptionalities. And being able to be a part of each one of these individuals' growth into their independence, into their, their lives, can really help change ours uh, to be the key word inclusive. Okay, everybody, drink of water and we're getting on the bikes. Break. Your eyes up, keep pedaling, you got this. I can't I can do the hard uh, thing. You got the pedal. Yes, yeah, so. Eyes up. Watch out. You got it, Leslie. Pedal, pedal, pedal. Nice. Good Eyes power. up. Leslie's making great progression, even though she's very scared. That stability is really hard for her. It's getting that connection from her mind to her muscles to pedal, and she's doing it, which is the biggest excitement for me because she's going to be independent very soon. Leslie. Riding a bike for the first time is a huge monumental accomplishment. For individuals with exceptionalities, the bike is a perfect tool to incorporate multifunctional skills to accomplish the same thing that their peers were accomplishing when they were younger and give them um, the right that they have to enjoy the outdoors. Foot down. Yeah! <laughs> nice! That was all you. Adventure for all, right? Yeah. yeah. Adventure for all. Adventure for all. <laughs> Good job. So proud of you. Has anyone been to Kohler before this first time? You've been to Kohler. Ah. Yeah. So when we ride the trails, the bike trails, we want them to be smooth and awesome to ride on, right? So we need people like you all to help keep them clean 
and smooth, okay? So we're gonna grab some tools and I'm gonna show you guys some things that we can do to help keep our park um, working and running so people can ride their bikes and have a good time. Does that sound good? Yeah. Yeah? All right. We're gonna clean up some trail. Having the kids be a part of cleaning up the trails, giving back to the community and to the park that they've been learning and, and riding in all week long, I think is an important uh, lesson and just uh, just to know that they can be a part of things too and give back. Uh, so it's really great. We've been uh, having fun and raking up and just you know giving back a little bit in nature. So I've been enjoying it. All right, so we're gonna bring a few of the athletes out here to experience what it's like to ride on the same trail that everyone else gets to ride on, right? So and that's what true inclusion is, is teaching them the skills and the tools to be able to come out here and explore Kohler the way it's meant to be explored and allowing them to have the skills and the confidence to do so. All right, so see the big hill? Oh, yeah, that'll hard. Push hard, push hard, push hard. There you go. Good, steer, steer, steer. Nice. You're in control. Nice. That's a big hill, girl. That's a blue. That's a blue hill. That's like a big, big, big hill, and you're facing it. Okay. Come on, Angle, you got Remember, it. Remember, feet up. Good job. You're gonna hold your brake. The last one, I promise. Mountain bike, give her a high five. Rock on, right? <laughs> yeah. That was awesome. Good job. With this being the first camp and the first workshop of this entire summer tour, I mean, we couldn't have asked for a more fulfilling week um, full of growth. You know, just so many miracle moments for these kids. You know, we had one athlete, their first time on a trail. You know, that was her dream. Um, a mom riding with her son on a bike was, was their dream. I mean, look at their smiles. Look at them going from I can't to I can. Look at the parents saying, now I'm gonna do whatever it takes because I know my kid can ride a bike now and I wanna ride with them. Them saying, my child is on a whole new trajectory for life. You know, I think it's those moments, those facial expressions, the, the confidence, that freedom. When you see them on the bike, and they're, and they're pedaling, their hands are on it, and you just see the smiles and this entire energy take over and that adrenaline, that rush of feeling alive, it just wakes them up and helps them realize that I can do hard things. We don't want you to point your compass north, we want you to point it towards fear. We want you to point your compass towards challenges. We want you to point your compass towards obstacles because following that direction in life and that path and that journey is a path that's full of growth. We've had so many people just kind of ask us, how can I help? How can I be a part of this? Subscribe, become a monthly donor, and be an incredible impact to this mission and this journey that we're on. And we'll see you in Lincoln, Nebraska. We cannot wait to get back on the road and head to Lincoln and create this same impact and feeling for their community. So we'll see you there. I can't walk. <laughs> I can't feel my leg. I gotta walk for a second. I can't feel my leg. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, definitely not. Hey, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, and share this mission with the world. And if I can't convince you, maybe Michael can. Not afraid of my fear? Not afraid of my fear. All right, my man. Come on. Subscribe to this video if I can do this.
Give me some. Ah!